Could your Craigslist, MySpace, or Facebook posting leave you in jail? It might do just that. We'll give you this news story and more next on Get the Daily. Hello everyone, welcome to the news edition of GetTheDaily.com. I'm Dana Ward with today's current news stories. Up first, Barbie has won. The four-year battle between the classic doll and the rival Bratz doll is over. A federal judge ordered MGA Entertainment to stop production of the Bratz dolls after ordering a total of $10 million in payment to Mattel for copyright infringement and breach of contract. The jury found that the Bratz designer created the Bratz idea while he was working at Mattel, and the longtime company claims that Barbie sales decreased when the edgier Bratz Bratz doll hit the market in 2001. And a San Diego teacher chose to sell advertisements for local businesses on his calculus exams. Tom Farber said that it's his solution to classroom budget cuts. He also said that he does not want this practice to be the norm and that the government should step up to help educators provide for their students. Farber used the $300 plus dollar ad sales to pay for the costs of printing exams. A Colorado man got charged with two counts of criminal libel due to his online Craigslist posting. The 40-year-old allegedly posted unflattering comments about his former lover on the website's rants and raves section in November 2007. Specifically, the man reportedly suggested that the woman traded sexual favors for legal services from her attorney. The law being used to charge the man is in question as to if it is outdated. It's a state law from the 1800s that allows people to be jailed for the content of their speech or writing. That's the news edition from Get the Daily. I'm Dana Ward and we'll see you right back here for more news updates.